Hello, Michael Warriors. This is Matthews, and it is Inner Sphere Quirk D Day on November 4th, 2014. I'm going through some of my new mechs that have been uh, upgraded and tweaked with the addition of quirks. And for this next match, I will be playing the awesome Pretty Baby for the first time with its buffs. So, uh, the most notable quirk that's been added for this guy is a 50% total cooldown on the large laser, which I happen to have in the arm, so that guy should be able to output a lot of damage. Uh, there's also been some improvements or reductions in the cooldown for missiles as well, as well as uh, laser range. So I'm going to give this guy a try and see how it handles missiles. In addition, the previous negative quirks for deceleration that were on this mech have been removed. So it should handle a whole lot better than it used to. Let's give it a try. If you happen to see my previous video on the Locust that had the ER large laser buff, the large laser in this guy pretty much behaves the same Boy, I might have to consider removing the large pulse in the torso and then using the arm one, or putting an additional regular large instead of the pulse. Although the range on the pulse, because of the buffs, goes up to 411, so it can reach out almost as far. And this is without the modules. I have no modules in this guy, right? Actually, regarding the awesomes, one thing to note too is that they did add some extra armor into the torsos, I believe, so it should be a little bit more survivable as well. button. You need to remember that my streaks are on my right trigger and the LRMs are on my left. Target acquired.
Target destroyed. New target acquired. I would say this mech is a lot more effective than it used to be. A whole lot better. Removing the uh, negative movement alone is... I have this guy going about 85, and you're going 85 kilometers in an assault mech. You get on somebody, and they're not going to be able to get away. I may be using this mech a lot more than previous. Yes, I approve. 